Hi everyone, I am back again with another video about uh, solar. Uh, if you've been following my channel, you know, you know that I live in Singapore and we have sun all year round. So this particular setup is actually the first uh, solar setup that I did uh, inside my room. So I just want to run through the whole setup with you and show you how easy it is to actually set something similar like this um, up inside your house. Uh, so let's uh, jump right into it. Okay, so this is just outside my room. You can see that I've got six, um, six solar panels over here. Uh, each panel is uh, generating about 100 watts. Um, all these six panels are actually connected in a series and, it, uh, and it's going straight into a charge controller that's, uh, that's actually over here. So what I've done all the um, I've put these panels up on the on the roof, and all the solar panels are actually connected uh, to these wires, and all these wires actually goes into the charge controller over here. So this metal piece that you see over here is essentially the charge controller, and that basically regulates all the power that's coming from the sun and it goes uh, straight into there we go that, that's, this is the charge controller over here and this is where it would regulate the power from the from the solar panels and it will then start to charge the big guy over here the 200 AH battery and it's all a, it's all a series of connections you know positive negative and um, with this inverter you will then be able to power a lot of your appliances. Um, this is 2000 watts, so it's good. I mean, you can power essentially like um, the laptops, um, anything, you know. I mean, just look at the power requirement on the adapters. It would, there was always an indication of how much you can, how much power you can actually use. Um, I actually used it to power the two monitors that I have here. Um, I've got my NAS, um, my Mac Pro, yeah, it basically powers everything over here. What I really like about it is that um, it's got um, four, four power sockets and I've actually connected another USB uh, charging station. So again, this charges all my electrical appliances and um, the power sockets here goes to multi-plugs that I could just uh, swap around and you know you could just step up your whole charging game all together it charges all my power banks as you can see over here so essentially um, all my power banks are charged via solar so how do I know um, when the uh, when the 200AHC lead acid battery is uh, fully charged I use this this is actually a, um, a uh, MT5 meter so it's telling me that it's receiving power from the sun and on a sunny day like this um, right now it's uh, it's at hundred percent so yep so this is what I use to monitor how much power I have in my um, sealed lead acid battery all right so what you just saw is actually a very basic setup um, of uh, how you could run like a, a simple solar system um, to charge all your electrical appliances. Um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to ask. And in the next coming video, I'm gonna be showing you something a little bit more advanced, um, a slightly bigger uh, inverter. Um, and then in another video, I will actually show you how I've actually um, worked with uh, a vendor in Singapore to set up solar panels on my roof. So until the next video, you take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.